Hi, I'm Todd Heiking, the owner of Dakota Angler here in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, with this week's two-minute fishing report. Well, folks, I guess Mother Nature has changed its mind once again and decided to go back to late summer or early fall type of weather. But I don't think there's too many people, honestly, that are arguing or complaining about it. It has allowed a lot of people to hit the lakes lately, as well as uh, for those that can't hit the lakes that have decided to catch up on the outdoor chores that were supposed to be done a while back, uh, i.e. me. Uh, and, uh, but those that have gone out and hit the lakes have done quite well. Uh, some of the lakes that produced walleyes this past week include uh, Wabe, and a lot of nice fish have been caught out of Wabe this past week. Uh, other lakes include Ponset, Dry Lake by Willow Lake, Thompson, uh, a few at Sinai, Madison has been doing quite well. Uh, and then also Island and Diamond, but you have to sort quite a bit there. Uh, Beaver and Vermilion, a few walleyes being caught. And also Twin Lakes. Twin Lakes has been phenomenal. Uh, but the, the biggest problem there is obviously you can't catch anything or haven't been ca catching anything large enough to keep. And it has to be 28 inches or larger to keep. But if you're looking for a fun place to go, that would be the place. Missouri River has been doing really well as, at the same time uh, from boat as well as shore. And the shore bite seems to be best uh, towards evening and uh, post-sunset hours. Uh, guys have been throwing uh, some uh, you know, floating wraps out there, also some jigs and minnows and doing quite well and some nice quality fish being caught on the Missouri River. And that seems to be the bait of choice or the presentation of choice this past week. It's been live bait, minnows uh, and jigs. Uh, then uh, if you're not going to use live bait, uh, it seems like walleye assassins or salmo plastics uh, on the jigs have been working as well. And then as far as the perch bite is concerned, not as many people going out finding the perch right now because a lot of people have been putting their boats away. Uh, but uh, Big Stone, uh, Ponset, uh, also uh, Thompson has been catching a few, and then also Dry Lake by Willow Lake, just to name a few. And what have the guys been doing to catch them? Again, the same thing that's been working the past couple of weeks. Uh, jigs, small jigs, tungsten, drop chain lures, uh, tipped with mid small minnows, wax rooms, or maggots. In this week's version of Todd's Tackle Tips, we're going to continue talking about the Ice Institute, because why? Well, folks, next week is Ice Institute Week, November 13th to the 15th at the Sioux Falls Arena and Convention Center. $5 to get into the door, and parking is absolutely free. If you are interested in ice fishing, folks, this is the place that you're going to want to be at. You're not going to find any better deals any place else, deals that are going to be unmatched anywhere across the upper Midwest. So, again, you're going to want to be here November 13th to the 15th at the Sioux Falls Arena and Convention Center. And what we're going to talk about this week is I'm going to give you a list of some of the vendors that have never been here before. In other words, it's their first time here at the show. And uh, if you part, you know, if you, I'm, I apologize, but I'm going to have to read it off a note uh, because there's that many. So bear with me. Foremost Fabrication, Ace Rods, Any Glide, Arctic Anchor, Black Hole Ice Shacks, Cherry County Tourism, Elliott Rods, Tubi Rods, Hardcore Outdoors, Helm Marine, Lakewood Products, Maynard's Tackle, Line Cutters, Minnow Hopper, North 40 Fab, Northern Lights Ravel Reels, On the Go Flagpole, One Last Cast, Overkill Metals, Razor Ice Augers, Reineke Chiropractic, Scooter J Rods, Thalman's Guide Service, Tempte tra Trailers, Tuned Up Custom Rods, SP S2B Outdoors, Urtec Ice, Walla Wallace, excuse me, Wallace Decoys, Wild Jay's Fishing Adventures, and Shane Guy's Guide Service. And that's not to mention all the other ones that have been here before that will still be on hand. Over 100 vendors will be on hand at the uh, 12th Annual Dakota Angler Ice Institute. So, folks, I've given you over 30 reasons and, honestly, over 100 reasons why you don't want to miss the Ice Institute. And, yes, we are taking the safety precautions uh, that we are working with the City of Sioux Falls Health Department to ensure that we have this, everyone's health and safety in mind. We're going to be, you know, asking that people mask up. Uh, they're not, it's not mandatory, uh, but it, we're going to encourage it. Also, uh, hand sanitizer will be readily available throughout the entire venue site, as well as we're going to also encourage social distancing. So, again, folks, if you're interested in ice fishing, don't miss the Dakota Angler Ice Institute November 13th through the 15th at the Sioux Falls Arena and Convention Center. If you have any questions whatsoever, don't hesitate to give us a call at 605-336-336. 9132. Now it's time to take a look at a few photos that you sent in to me this past week. And remember folks, if you'd like your photo included in next week's version of the Two Minute Fishing Report, please send it to me. Send it to Todd at DakotaAngler.com or post it to our Facebook wall. 
And if I use your photo, your name will be entered into a monthly drawing for a $25 gift certificate. And folks, before we end this week's report, I want to remind you of all the different ways that you can stay up to date with the latest happenings here at Dakota Angler. And it's through social media. And when some of the different accounts that we have, are, we have a Facebook account as well as Twitter, Instagram, as well as Snapchat. And then if you're not on social media, you can also go to our website at dakotaangler.com. And folks, that's a great way that if you can't make it to the store, all of our inventory that you see around me and behind me uh, is available online. And then you can order it and we'll ship it out to you the next day. And of course, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to give us a call at 605-336-9132. Well, that's this week's version of the 2-Minute Fishing Report. For Dakota Angler, I'm the owner, Todd Heitkamp. And as we say around here, fish on! We'll see you next week, folks. And again, remember, the Ice Institute, November 13th through the 15th. Stay healthy, stay safe, and again, thanks for watching.